Good day, lords and ladies of the internet. I am your host, the Parafox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet, and today I'm here to bring you a game called Once Upon a Coma. Now, this is a game I found on Game Jolt, so as you can see at the bottom, that in the middle there even, it says support on Kickstarter. So, we're going to play through this game and see what we can find. So, if you would please. Hello there. Hmm. That's a jump. Oh, space bar. And a piano. Which, in which we can play. Using the actual signs on the keyboard, which makes it a little awkward. But, never mind. Let's move on, I suppose? Hmm. I like the little animations. S got no idea what we're doing. Reading Park. Okay, locked. Hmm. Ooh, the, pia the piano is really nice in the background there. Well, locked. I still have no idea where I seem, where I think I'm meant to be going. I think I should try and meet that guy up there. So, how do I get up? Oh! I can go in here. What do we have in here? Hmm. An old pub? A, me a message is written on the mirror. Ooh. B-A-C. Pete, don't forget our favorite place. Lily. It seems important. Huh. Hello there. Long time no see, Pete. It's me, John. Hi, John. What do you think about my hair? I've been growing it out. It looks great. Long hair looks great. I will hear nothing else. I think it's fab. I, I may be a girl this year, I think. Anyway, I bet the gang will be super glad you woke up. It's been weird since you were fell asleep. Really? Yeah. It's spooky without the grown-ups here. Lily went looking for them, and Ralphine barricaded the entrance to Redding, Fe Redding and Field with behind me. Lily? You know, Lily, your sister. She said something about... She said something needed to be done. About? It's kind of weird. Ever since the grown-ups disappeared, things have been... Odd. Whatever, but whatever. As long as I can eat ice cream and bacon for dinner every night, I couldn't give two farts where the grown-ups are. <laughs> well then. Huh. What about the guy that was up here? What? Who's he and what does he have to say? Hello there. Haha, <laughs> can't believe it's actually you, Pete. We honestly didn't think you'd make it out of your coma. What coma? It's been a while since you were awake, Pete. You really don't remember what happened? Nope. Well, I'm glad you're back. I do wonder, though. Thanks for telling me. If you still got it in you. What? Man, you've really forgotten everything, haven't you? We used to call you the Slice. The Slice? You had the coolest razor from your dad's barbershop. And? That thing was that thing was sharp. Your sister thought you were so cool. Where is she? She tried to be all macho and go find the grown-ups. Ever since they went missing, she acted like it was a huge deal. It's not. Not by my book. All right then. Well, BAC. So all I can assume from BAC is the piano. So let's go to it. BAC.
That's a thing. What's in the chest? OCM. OSCAM's razor. A, a razor. A straight edge razor. A straight edge razor with an intricate black wood handle and a sharp heavy blade. It aches painfully. Clo it aches for a painfully close shave. This game is clearly meant to be made, played on a controller, but I'm playing with the keyboard at the moment. Right. So I have the razor now. So I guess I need to figure out what I'm meant to do with this razor. I should probably go to the, talk to the kid who was, who was mentioning the razor, considering I have the razor now. You know, I just realized the animation, so I'm ho literally hopping along. That's adorable. The art style is amazing. Okay, I can't talk to you. So where am I meant to go? Hmm. Uh, I'm reading it again. Nope, sorry, stop. Well, come on, so where are we meant to go? Maybe over here. No. Oh, I can attack now. Sure. Why do I need to attack? Reddingham Field. The fact that there's an attack action makes me a little precarious. Pete, it's me, Bird. You woke up. Hey, what's up? I'm locked in this cage. That's what's up. You sound upset. Your little sister went to go fight to look for the grown-ups. I told her not to go, but she ran to Shillian Wood. Really? Yes, and the dude, and dude, the grown-ups, they're all gone. All of them. They just started vanishing. Yikes. Listen, Pete, your sister's gone, been gone for a couple of weeks, and it can't be good. You might want to prepare for the worst. Let's go find her. Okay, quick, let me out this cage and we'll head to Shillian Wood. Getting a little claustrophobic in here, man. Would you mind? Okay, so what do I need to do to get you out of there? That. I can jump and attack. Okay. I have a Na'vi. I've just realized that. It better not be as annoying. Okay. Who the hell are you? <laughs> what? Oh yeah, hey Pete, up here, do you see me? Yeah, you're kind of hard to miss. It's none of your business to look at me, the mighty ninja. Gomboisa. Right. You don't know how amazing my swinging powers are. How do you swing like that? Worm buttholes. But that's neither here nor there. I swing and swing all... I swing, swing, swing all day, and hide from spiders, you know. Sure. Sure you do. Totally glad you understand. Most people don't understand. We're just going with the facts we understand. Hey, where have you been all summer, Pete? A coma, apparently. You're funny. We all... We all know you were just sleeping in. Doof... Doofus poopus. Man, I'm funny. Wanna be fr wanna be funny friends? Yeah, okay, why not? Great! I'll be here I'll be here being funny and powerful. You go now! Okay, funny friend? Watch out for spiders! They start getting worse when all when all the grown-ups decided to disappear. Well, I guess we found our enemy type. Let me just kill all the pumpkins. For no apparent reason. And also cut the grass. Okay, what's this thing? Do I even want to know what- Oh wait, you're stuck in a well, not behind a wall. Huh. Maybe my mind shouldn't go places from the looking at the image and the sounds in the background. To be fair, it was a little misleading. Hey there! Hey, puke face, get over here and help me! How does this happen? It was, isn't it obvious, puke? No. 
I have hypno-inflammatory disorder. I defecate randomly. Okay, most people would just say you're fat. I've been eating cream, cream cheese tacos all summer, and my mom wasn't here to give me my insulin, so I inflated. Right. It's a disorder, but you wouldn't look. But you, but, but you wouldn't know, would you? Sleeping all summer like a lazy butt. Did you hear that? I swore. Sure you did. What can I do? Give me my insulin. Are you deaf? Are you deaf? Puke fart. Where? Those little turds, the spiders. Snatched it up right from uh, right from my pocket and ran up a tree. I'm on it. Who are you? Watch out for Pukey. That's me, Pukey. Oh, Punky. Sorry. I've got into the habit from the last guy. Hi, Punky. Fancy said I should go, uh, go and find help, but I'm too busy dancing. Do you like my dance moves? Eh, that could be better. But yeah, sure, why not? I'm insane with dance. I can hear music in my mind, and I just dance pretty well all, pretty much all day and night. Really? Nah. Want to hear the real reason I'm dancing? Sure. Well, a sneaky spider came up and whispered in my ear. Want to know what he said? Well, I'm give, gonna consume this as a continuation of the story you said before about the reason you're dancing, so yes, I would like to know. He said, if I ever stopped dancing, they would pinch my left butt cheek off and feed it to your mum. Ha 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 ha, you stupid little puke. The kids on this side of town aren't very nice. Right. So, where's this spider gonna be? Oh, there's one. Ow! Combat! Kill the spiders! Arachnophobia! The fuck is this? A jump pad? Okay. Sure. Why not? More spiders! Kill them all! health bar. If I do, I don't know what it is. Uh. Oh, there's the insulin. Pete, check it out. In the tree. Is that the insulin? Go grab it, bird. Okay. So he's our inventory management system, is he? He's the one carrying the items for us. That's pretty neat. We can hold one item at a time, or something like that. Oh. Gotta make sure I cut the grass. No adults here are here to do it, so... There you go. My insulin! Give me my butt insulin, butt face! Here. Pop me! It hurts so bad, but you have to pop me. Okay. Three, two, one. Go, go, go. Stop. I think you're deserving of that. Let's head down and see what there is. Oh, that's it. Thank you for supporting Indies. Support the Kickstarter to awaken Pete's adventure on S on Steam and Game Jolt. Ah, that was actually a lot shorter than I was expecting it to be. Well, this is going to be a short episode, isn't it? I apologise for that, people. I was I didn't know what I was expecting actually, but then again, I suppose this is only a demo. So. If you like what this is, consider kickstarting the, helping kickstart the game. I know I certainly like the appearance of it, the little atmosphere behind it, the fact the piano was played. So I wonder if we'll have more puzzles like that piano. I, the little animations and everything, everything seems to work out quite well. 
There's even a combat system, which no, not all of these types of games have. So, everyone, this has been a little short, a short little game. Again, I apologise that it's a little short today, but what can you do with these things? So, everyone, I'd like to thank you all for watching. I have been your host, the Parafox Archangel, the English gentleman of the internet. And again, consider kickstarting this g game. I certainly like the, the appearance of it. So, I'm afraid for now, until tomorrow, it is now time for me to bid the all farewell, good day, and finally, good night.